Welcome back to the dig. So let's do a quick recap here. We talked to this inventor who made the life crystals and a way to access space time six for his people, um, which apparently grants you basically everlasting life and infinite unimaginable be and unimaginable beauty, if you know what I'm getting at. Um, but at the cost of eternal life in which you can't really do anything so everyone wants to come back home and they're saying we need they're trying to contact us which explains the ghosts and and, and uh, they're hoping we can at least rescue them now we want to go home this guy says not to do that and he's not going to help us do that um, I think he said the only way we could do that would be to bring back some of the ancient ones that are in space time six um, so I don't have a clue about that but um, he made a, he made a good point though. Uh, he said you have two options. You can re if if you were to return home and warn people not to do it, or stay here and no one would ever know, which is more likely to actually prevent people from coming here and doing the thing. So that is a good point. If no one knows about the place, they can't come here, right? What are, what are the odds that we go back home and be like, Hey, the guys, don't don't go do that. And then everyone goes and does the thing. So, yeah, but I don't, I don't know if that's actually an option in the game. Uh, regardless, what do we have? Okay. No. Only, only with certain conditions, and they would have to be pretty specific. Exactly. We all know some dirt munchers. Probably. Um, I don't think we need to talk to him anymore is the thing. I mean, maybe, but... You know what? Let me see what Maggie has to say right now. Robins. Okay, no, nothing new. We could go check on Brink, maybe? So, the alien also said to connect... Once we connect all the light bridges, then we'll be able to... Uh, <laughs> I was not. <laughs> I was not a dirt muncher. Well, we should be able to see something in the middle there. I don't know what exactly, but I believe he said... Oh, no, he said that might actually open up the portal to Space Time 6. But he also mentioned finding all the metal plates would do that. So... Um... Oh, there is one area I'd like to go to. Is that here? It's wherever that beach is with, like, the green energy field. Let's go check that out. And because now that Maggie's just following us around, who knows, she might have something to say about, like, things, you know. We could go talk to Brink. I think we might have tried that, though, so I'm going to skip that for the moment. I don't think... Yeah, no, we don't want to do the tram. Let's do the light bridge. Where was that? Map Spire Museum. <laughs> Yikes. Planetarium. I b believe it was map? Ads. Okay. Nothing tells me, at least on OBS, nothing tells me that there's ads going right now. Oddly enough. So I don't even know if uh, anyone on Twitch can see me right now. I'm going to continue for the sake of YouTube. Plus, there's not a lot to see, but I'll walk slow. I would like some type of notification about that. Oh, well. Okay, there's the nest. There's the ledge. Okay, so there's this opening here. Yes, this. Um, let's see if Maggie knows anything about this. Look at it, Maggie. It shimmers, but it doesn't seem real. A kind of light that's just on the edge of existence. Something like this. You'd think they would have written about it somewhere. They've written about every other phenomenon here. They didn't? Question mark? Tablet, maybe? 
I can't use these two things together. Can you look at this inscription, Maggie? Maybe she can make sense of it here. Does it say anything that might help? Welcome back. We just it missed the walk. That's about it. It wasn't clear to me before, but now I can see. Ah. What's she see? Boston. It exactly describes that strange field of almost light. Okay, but what does why? it say? It's a set of instructions. Now it makes perfect sense. Two. I just twist this. Oh wow. What's going on? That everything's so simple when you read the directions. If we didn't know better, we'd think that island had been there for a million years. I mean, yeah. Okay. Um, let's go to the island, because of course that's suddenly there. This island was brought back from another dimension. But why? What's it do? What's, what's this do for us? Oh, uh, there's an opening there. Oh, look what we found. What was so important that they left us exact instructions on how to get here? Maybe that metal plate over there. The final piece. Interesting. That's the fourth one. If it's like the metal plates on Attila, these four should fit together in that triangle matrix. Mm-hmm. Yes, but there's no guarantee that putting them together will take us anywhere we want to go. You have the most cheerful thoughts, Ms. Robbins. Ms. If you had been abducted by a monster and then half drowned, you might be pessimistic too. Fair. But you lived, didn't you? And your hair looks terrific again. <laughs> nudge, you nudge, sure know wink, how to wink. make a girl feel good. We'd better go find Brink again. Mm, disagree. In case these metal plates do the job. That's true. He threatened to kill me the last time I saw him. Maybe it would be safer if we leave him and send an expedition back to get him later. An armed expedition. Hmm. There's no guarantee we'll ever get back. For all we know, this is a one-way trip. You're right. We can't leave him. He scares me, Boston. Worse than the monster. He is They're both creepy. just hungry for something. But Brink is smarter, more dangerous. We're smart too. Let's go. Hmm. Here's I'm kind of surprised that we found the plate before another engraved rod. Because Whoa, hold on. That was a powerful one. Commander Low, can you hear me? Brink, we're looking for you. We've got the last of the metal plates and we... Listen to me, Commander. I'm trapped. I need your help. Where are you? It's near one of the light bridges. An arch bridge over a waterfall and then into a crevice in the rock. You must have been there. You're the one who's been turning on all the light bridges, aren't you? Hold tight, we're on our way. Hold tight! Very funny! Okay. This is the- this is coming to the part I keep talking about. That might be a little difficult and disturbing to some viewers. Parental guidance recommended. <laughs> We know what he's talking about, right? The arched bridge, the uh, waterfall, the crevice in the rock. We're all familiar with that particular piece of land. It's in the planetarium spire. I was gonna say though, I'm surprised we found the metal piece that will do something different than unlock this final spire that we haven't gone to yet, because we're still missing that other door. 
but uh, all we can think about right now is Brink. And despite him being kind of obsessed, I still don't think he's worth completely abandoning. Um, I think he needs to come back home, get a, get a, go to a few therapy sessions, you know. All right, let's see this. You just got your hand jammed in the rock? I thought you were in real trouble, Brink. Uh, when would it be real trouble, Commander? When it's your hand? I don't go sticking my hand in the cracks. <laughs> I was reaching for a life crystal, and then the rock shifted. My circulation is cut off. No blood is getting to my hand. You can't pull me out, Commander. Don't leave me to die here, even if you have to cut off my hand. Don't be so dramatic, Brink. Nobody's going to cut off your hand. Don't make promises you might not be able to keep, Maggie. Are you serious? He's just got a stuck hand. It's a race to see whether gangrene kills him before he dies of thirst or starvation. You'd cut it off. Of course he would. The military trains you to recognize necessity and do it. It would be easier if I had anything to cut it with. Chew it off then! <laughs> oh, I would, Brink. But human teeth can't bite through bone. After all that's happened to us, this may be the most horrible. Do something, Commander! Do it now! Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm going to save this as a an option called choice, and if I remember, at the end of the game, I will come back and do the other thing, because it does give a different result. However, what can we do with little old Brink? Can I leave? I think you can, actually. I th I'm pretty sure you can leave him. Yeah. No, you can totally... I, um, I'm fairly certain you can go finish the game, because we have the plate now. And you can just leave him there to die. Say, you know, so long, sucker. Sucks to be you. But, uh... He is a human, and although he's been a rather bit of a jerkwad, he's, uh... He's still part of the team, and he needs to come back with us. Therefore, let's talk to him. Frank, how are you holding up? <laughs> My hand has been pulverized, but the pressure from the rocks is keeping me from bleeding to death. That sounds painful, to be honest. Can we give him a life crystal? That won't do the trick. Okay. What do we have that, could, that we think we could saw through human bone? Anything? The tusk is just a point. A shovel, maybe? Um... Maybe the rib cage. There's the jawbone. I mean, there's the newly acquired metal plate. You want to use the shovel? Just whack it off. Phrasing. I. I can try that. I don't. I know that. I'm pretty sure I know the item I need to use. I don't know if it'll let me use anything else, but I'll try this. That would help Brink. How? <laughs> Just knock him out first, maybe. <laughs> thunk, thunk, a blunt metal instrument. Whack. Poor Brink. What about the ribcage? That won't do the trick. Okay, folks. I'm going to use the thing. We're going to get this jawbone that we acquired from the graveyard in the, on the surface, if we recall. And we're going to saw his hand off. He ain't going to like it. Oh. Okay, yeah, we better get this done. You're going to saw off his hand with a jawbone? The teeth are razor sharp. What about anesthetic? You got some? Do it, Commander! Brace yourself, Brink. Mm -hmm. 
I can't believe you endured so much pain without fainting. I'm fine, but I'll need more crystals. Come with us to the Triangle Matrix. We've got all the metal plates. We think it's gonna take us home. You don't know where it's going to take you. I'd rather gather more life crystals. What if it does take us home, Brink? What if we can't come back and get you? Do you want to stay here forever? Then what will happen to your research into the life crystals? Yes, I see your point. I'll go with you to try out these metal plates. But if it doesn't get us home, then you two will stop interfering with me from then on. Agreed. All right? All right. You agree we have a Agreed. deal? Agreed. Deal. Agreed. I would shake on it, but... Uh, all right, all right. Somebody just lost their hand. Ugh, that was something. Um... Yeah, what's this gonna do? Final plate going in. Keep in mind... He wasn't like this at the beginning, so we don't know if this is like his actual mind that's been altered or if he's just went crazy with obsession, bumping nubs. <laughs> oh man. Same type that panel. That should do it. And do what? What's happening? Let's Nothing see. is happening. That's what. Hold on. That's not exactly nothing, Brink. It's a door. You think Earth is on the other side? I think nothing is on the other side. What did you expect? The Tooth Fairy to come and fly us all home? The door opened. Let's go see what's in there. We had a deal. I came, these metal plates did not take us home, and now you will have to leave me alone forever. You gave me your word, and I expect you to keep it. Clearly. He is definitely insane. Is that your opinion as a journalist? It's my opinion as a sane person. <laughs> yeah, I don't think there's anything we can do for him at this point. We saved his life, probably, and... Uh... I guess let's go through the open door. It's a tram station. Oh, so this just takes us to the final spire then. Okay. It better work. Then we can activate the final light bridge. See what the deal is with the middle there. And, uh... I don't know. Don't have a good feeling about that, though. All talk of unlocking things uh, related to Space Time 6. We're going home! Okay, this is different. What spire is this? Oh, okay. Thought we were just going to stare at each other for a minute. I guess I need to go. Robins. Nope. Oh, I guess we'll... Yeah, sure, let's talk about the island. And Brink, just in case. What if I hadn't noticed that inscription and taken it with me? We could have wandered around here until we died without ever finding that island. Wait, where did I find that? They hide it. Then they help us find it. Who can understand why aliens do what they do? I forget maybe where I took that tablet up in the first place. I don't think you can soft lock the game. Maybe now. it's a test of our dumb luck. Or our persistence. At least not this one. As worried as I am for Brink, I can't help feeling a little angry at him. He's wacko. Nuts. Out of We've said that before. We'll skip it. Thanks. Thanks for calling Brink those nasty names. <laughs> Alright, what's beyond door number one? Okay. I saw something like this in the museum display. This okay. machine was the greatest of the inventor's achievements. Um, what does it do? I haven't the faintest idea. 
Do you think it might send us home? Right now, it's doing nothing. Well, there's the console, the console, the strange object, the strange object. Um, boy, let's, I guess, use the tablet on something and hope for the best? It won't do anything. It's a row of crystalline devices. Okay. It won't do anything. Can I... Okay, that's wonky, but I'll take it. So that one's going. Let's get this one going. This is bizarre. Wait, that... Now the other one's stopped. Okay, I'm a little slightly confused. Can I go up that way? Oh, uh, gap in machinery. Can I put a life crystal in there? It's green. That doesn't fit here. Well darn. Okay, missing a thing. Hmm. It looks like there's a part missing here. There's a gap. There's a gap. So obviously I don't have that yet, right? Doesn't look like it. Let's see if we can walk up here. that aha oh there's more a lot more <coughs> oh good green crystal um I don't that, know how to work these controls I don't think so I think that's those are the like the engraved rods for opening the door I was gonna try that then I was like nah but if I if I come back here with no other options, then I will try that. Ah, uh, what's that? Okay. I can't... I can't keep all of these things activated is the problem. Oh, it's just one or the other. It's not... Uh, ooh, I'm so confused. Let's keep going. I don't know what to do with this device. Fair. Okay. Light bridge, maybe? Yes, but... Oh, there's a nest there. Sorry, bird. Sorry, bird. You'll have to find a new home. He'll be fine. <laughs> oh, he landed. Oh, don't be so rough with it. That's so mean. All right. It did work. It didn't sound right. Okay, let's, uh... I guess go to the middle and see what we find. Wow, what's that? It doesn't look safe to walk there. Well, hold on. I thought he said... Did he not say that activating all of the light bridges would, like, open something for us, or no? Okay, maybe I'm mistaken, but... Never mind, I guess? Um... Cathedral Spire. Okay, I know Brink doesn't want to be bothered. We're gonna go bother Brink because maybe he has a piece that we need. Unless he's not here, which would be great. He's here. Hi, Brink. You're creepy. Get away from here! I won't let you break my life crystal machine! Oh, that's what you're doing. We don't want to break anything. My machine isn't working yet. Yes, gloat if you want to. I've studied all the inscriptions. 
Maggie's not the only one who can decipher strange languages. I followed the plans I found, but there's still something missing, and without it the machine won't work. So if you think you can steal my life crystals again, Commander Lowe, think again. I'll kill you first, and believe me, no one will ever revive you. Actually, you've robbed me twice, and I only robbed you once. <laughs> so you're still one ahead. Don't joke with me! Don't joke with him, Boston. Okay. Go away! My work is very important. You can't possibly understand what I'm doing here. You're building a life crystal machine. Is there anything we can give him? I don't think we want to, but, like, what about the tablet? What are you? I don't have time to waste on foolish discussion of nothing. Understandable. Okay, I don't think that's gonna be of any help. It's not gonna let us get close. I won't stand here and let you distract me from my achievements. Okay. <sighs> what can we possibly do that we haven't done before? I guess go talk to the alien again? Oh, we were there already. Whoops. Yes, it does. Speak. Ah, there it is. Okay. Well, there's the island. I guess we'll ask about that first. The island we found, where was it hidden? It left this reality, but only a little way. It can come back, because it never fully left. Okay. The island moves in and out of our reality? It loses substance with every passage. We thought we could take our world with us into space time six. Okay, that explains it. Could it could not be done. They tried to bring their world with them. When something leaves our reality, where does it go? To a place where time is infinite in all directions. But because it does not move along a single line, it can never be predicted or controlled. Hmm. Those who go there from here cannot change anything. They are nothing but observers. Forever. Sounds like you're not supposed to go there. That's just my opinion. Sounds like that's the inner workings of the universe and you're not really supposed to mess with it, but you can. You, know, you can go in there and watch, but then, uh, kind of stuck. The machine in your laboratory, what does it do? Where the lights all shine, it opens the eye. Where the light, okay. The light bridges then? The eye. Does that <laughs> mean the crystal at the meeting place of the light bridges? The machine generated this eye. The eye sees into all space and time, and where the eye sees, the mind can fly. Okay. Was this eye the doorway into the place where your people went? A door that can be crossed only one way. You don't know that. If someone has a strong enough tie to reality... Do you think you are stronger than all my people? I don't. Even they. The strongest race known could not overcome the temptation before it was too late. Hmm. If we bring your people back to this world, then they can build a starship to take us home to Earth. It's our only chance. Maybe we'll fail, but you must let us try. Since you think you are stronger and wiser than my people, hmm. I will let you have the fruit of your pride. This could be bad. I will tell you how to find the piece I hid. If you know how to ask. If I know how to ask. But it will cost you more than you ever imagined. 
So he did hide that piece. Oh. Okay. Let's ask about the light bridges first. When you say the eye will see. Oh, we said that already. An eye that can see the three dimensions. Three of dimensions, time, time and space, etc. Okay. The eye may be open. Yes, we saw that. Okay. Give him Brink. He doesn't want Brink. <laughs> Who wants Brink? All right. Please don't play any more games with us. Where is the missing piece? You cannot understand what will begin if you activate the eye. You cannot bear to pay what it will cost you. I mean, as long as we don't go in, we're fine, right? Yes, you've warned us. Now where is the piece? Go to the map with this message and see what it shows you. Okay. He's giving us an engraving rod, I guess? Yes, okay. I'm gonna ask again, because it's still not blue. I have said enough. He said enough. Okay. Yeah, I wish we could have asked... Um... Oh, we kind of did. We talked about the glowing crystals, and he said it, it gives you life, but not life worth living. Thank you for helping us. So... Help yourselves by giving up. Never look into the impossible eye. You don't have the strength to return from that place. I get it. We're not planning on going to that place. We're trying to bring your people back, which is what everyone wants us to do. I get your warnings. I get that you're upset at yourself for ruining everything. But trust us. We're humans. We never make mistakes. I'm not going to that place. So what do we got? A new rod. Easy enough. Okay. Now he said go to the map room with that. So let's see what it says. We are in the tomb spire. Which means we're going to have to go to the light bridge. Robins. Oh, wrong button. Oh, I guess I can talk about this. You get the idea that he really doesn't want us to succeed in repairing his machine. Let's just find the missing piece. Thanks. Okay. Since I'm here, I know everyone's going to hate me for this. I'm going to talk to Brink again. Just to make sure he's not coming with us. Got to make sure. Brink. There's this piece that we think will restart the eye. I don't care about whatever trivial tasks are keeping you occupied. Have you seen the large machine in the laboratory? It is a meaningless toy compared to what I am working on. I doubt that. Okay. Why do I bother? Talking to you is a waste of time. It is. I, I keep holding out hope for him, but who knows. All right, onward to the map one. Map Spire. It was blue pyramid, blue pyramid, red diamond, green diamond. Yes, okay. Welcome back. Um, when did you leave? I think you didn't miss anything. We talked to Brink real quick. He's, of course, not interested. So I'm inputting the pattern that the creator told us to do, and we'll see what it shows us. Uh, red diamond, green diamond, I believe. What is that? Is that the beach? That that might be the uh So that's where the part is. Okay. Assuming he gave us the right code. That is the oh, I always forget which spire that is. It's not Is it this one? Robins. No, oh, wrong button. Never mind. We might be on the on it. I think whatever the nest is. Yeah, it's this one.
Ugh. Bad memories of this place. Okay, the beach is here. Now, where did he hide that piece? I part? This? Huh, sure enough. I wish I knew what's going to happen when I get this piece back in place. Only one way to find out. Now we just have to go back to... The Cathedral Spire. Not the tram, not the tram. And... Let's see what happens. I'm glad it's kind of auto-walking for me. It's kind of an annoying place to walk in. So this should open the portal? Don't know what we're going to do from there, though. Oh, hi, Brink. Hi, what's up? Where have you been? Excuse me? Where have we been? I just talked to you. I need your crystals. All of them. Right now. Come on, Brink. How many crystals can one man use? Not for me, you fools. I need them for my machine. I mean, we don't need for them, science. right? science. Give them the crystals. Research. Give them to me. Machine? What are you talking about? I'm through talking. I'm not going to let anybody stand between me and the greatest scientific achievement in history. I only have these few crystals left, Brink, but I'll be glad to share some of them if you want. All of them! You didn't share anything, Lo. I took them! And it's a good thing you didn't fight me. I would have killed you to get these. You would have tried. <laughs> you two will be nothing but a footnote in the annals of my achievements. He didn't damage the machine part, did he? I mean, yeah, of course he doesn't deserve them, but at this point I just don't want anything to deal with him, so he wants some crystals? Fine, whatever, I'm not using them. Just take them and leave. Um, it looks like we're done with him, so... Let's do the thing to the machine and see what happens. It fits, but the machine still doesn't work. Did the alien lie to us? Don't jump to conclusions. Or does the machine need something else? I guess I'll take this with no, me. No, put it back. I, I'm pretty sure we need to, like, press something or... I don't know. Don't know what. It's a row of crystalline devices. What if we activate these things in order? Will they stop spinning? Because so far, every time I touch one, the previous one stops spinning. Yes. Yeah. Okay, they're still going. Well, are they? Oh, that one stopped. Dang it. Oh, that one stopped as well. Hmm. Those two are super quick. Even if I had her do the other ones down there, I don't think I could hit get to these two and like even if I, I was standing here. I don't know this device. I don't think I could do anything with it. Okay. Um. Hmm. 
I guess I need to talk to the inventor again, right? I don't know how to work these controls. I'll talk to Maggie first. Robbins. The part we found fits perfectly, but the machine still doesn't do anything. There's a place just the right size for life crystals, remember? Or did you notice? No, I didn't. What are you talking you about? You think it needs a life crystal to work? Great. Oh. Brink just stole them all. <laughs> of he stole course. yours, but he didn't steal mine. Hey. I have one. You do? Could have mentioned that. Of course. I carried one with me. What if you died? What if you died? It could happen. Even heroes get killed sometimes. Oh. Okay, give it to me. I'll put it in the machine while you're up there on the controls. Where? Oh. Okay. It started, but it only worked for a few seconds. Hmm. I think it needs more than one life crystal. Oh, of course it does. Maybe two. Maybe three. Maybe three hundred. Great. Brink's the only one who has any. By now, he's probably scoured every island and collected them all. Hmm. There is that one place that had a ton... But I'm sure he's cleared that, right? He wouldn't have came looking for our, like, three if he hadn't done that already. Hey, Brink, what's up? Brink. Come in, Brink. Right? Brink here. I read oh. you. Oh, now he's talking to us? I think I know what piece is missing from your machine. How can you know anything about this? You're not a scientist. You're just a strutting tin soldier. That little glitch I think it's was the super same creepy. Piece that the eye generator needed. Don't tell him that. I think it's the key to all this technology. The alien inventor hid it because without it, none of the machines he considers dangerous will work. Why would the creator of life crystals think they were dangerous? Yeah, why would because he the bring? Maybe you should think feel about so that. good that they take over your life. All you care about is getting more of them. He said it was the second worst mistake he'd made. And the worst mistake? The eye. So you and Maggie, you keep telling me I'm crazy. <laughs> but you plan to make an even worse mistake. I'll make you a deal, Brink. Yes, like the deal you made before. I keep my part, but you go back on it. I didn't go back on it. I just wanted to talk about it with you first. No deals with liars and thieves. Brink, hmm. you need what I have to make your machine work. But if it works, then you'll have plenty of life crystals, right? You could share them with us and it wouldn't cost you anything, right? If you have the missing part, yes. That's my deal. Okay. Your machine, my part. 50-50 on the life crystals. I know you plan to cheat me. We won't even come near the machine when it's running. You divide up the life crystals. Then what's to stop me from keeping them all? Because I am trained as a military man, Brink. And if I ever actually decide to fight you, I don't care how strong and healthy you are. You will lose. And then I will take them all. Got it? Get your missing part and put it in my machine. Even liars and thieves can bargain as long as they watch each other very carefully. I love how he keeps calling us the liar and thief, but then he's like, well, what if I keep them all? What if I cheat? What if I kill you? Half the life like, crystals, dude. Break. Remember? Pot, You don't kettle. scare me, you hairless monkey. Says the other hairless monkey. I'm totally going to go back and see what happens if we leave him there. 
After I finish, of course. Since we'll know what to do. How, how sad would that be if I get stuck on my second playthrough ten minutes after I finish? Alright, light bridge. Tomb spire. Cave interior. And then whatever the other scene is called. So maybe we don't need to talk to the inventor again. Although, should we? Sounds awful. Oh, I forgot to bring the piece. Crap, bear it back. Man, would have never heard the end of it. Alright. Do all the way down there again. I guess I'll take this with me. Yeah, that might help. Here's something that we hadn't, maybe, maybe not, haven't thought all the way through. I can't words today. Um, we're gonna give this piece to Brink. It's gonna turn on his infinite life crystal machine. He's going to generate crystals and give them to us, which we then cannot use because he's using the infinite life crystal machine. Correct? So, plan B. Bird's still looking for a nest. Push him off the cliff. He probably, you know, he hasn't made an official move on us yet besides the fist fight, which people don't deserve to die for. He, he has threatened, yes, but I'm not going to be the one to make that first move. He's just insane, and I don't know, his, his brain's corrupted or something, who knows. Alright, Brink. Hi. Got something Brink. for you. Remember our deal, Brink. I fix your machine, I get half the life crystals. But I divide them up. Yes, yes. I remember very well. Half the life crystals, Brink. Remember? It. <laughs> you don't scare me, you hairless monkey. I love how the exit words are the same as the uh okay remember our deal break. oh he's gonna say it again i fix your but okay. i remember use the ipod well. with the relic i just don't know how yet to link them up slot and it fits perfectly this is how the aliens design the life crystal machine to work Nothing's happening. Yes, it is. It's vibrating. Be patient. It's not Who knows patient, how man. fast it's supposed to work? We'll just have to wait. Suits me fine. We'll split them 50 50, right? Of course. 50 50. Look, there's one. Sure enough. And another! Two. Is that all? Just two? I need more than two. I don't know about that, Brink, but it's a sure thing I need more than one. Hmm. You still have all the crystals you stole from me and every other place on these islands. Don't touch them! Oh boy. 50-50, you said, Brink. Well, you must have hundreds of life crystals. That wasn't really the deal, to be honest. It's not even 50-50 if I take these two. I knew you were a liar and a cheat. You weren't gonna let me have even one of these. Mm-hmm. I'll make the machine even better. It will produce more. Not till we're gone, it won't. I need that machine part to run the eye generator. 
You will take nothing from this machine, you lying thief! Once the eye is working, you can either come back with us to Earth, or you can stay here, take the part out of the eye generator, and put it back in your own machine. Just have a little patience. He's not going to say anything about that. No! My machine is stopping! I took You've the... wrecked my machine! Dude! You're a dead man! Oh, boy. Brink, please. Oh, he's going to do it. We don't have to fight. He's going to... You can have the part back after we're done with it. Everything you say is a lie! Maggie, tell him. If you say a word, Maggie, I'll kill you too! Brink, don't make me hurt you. You won't hurt me when you're dead! Maggie's just using her phone. Ooh. Oh, hey! No! Brink! Well, that's one way to solve oh, the problem. Oh, Maggie, please believe me. I didn't want to hurt him. I didn't want him dead. It wasn't Brink who died here. Brink died when he fell down the hole when we first arrived. Hmm. What just fell over the cliff was someone else. Someone alien. Someone obsessed, Created at the very by least. those death crystals. Hmm. Maggie, are we making an even worse mistake? By activating the eye? Yeah, really bring him back. Staying in this world any longer than we have to, that's the worst mistake we could make. We've got to do anything we can to survive. But what if we die trying? Don't you get it, Boston? This place is worse than death. I'd rather die than stay here. Fair. Let's look down there real quick. Can we see anything? Just a really long drop. Okay. Well... <laughs> funny that's not the ending I remember I thought if you saved him he kind of changed and cleaned up his act a little bit and then was like with you at some conferences at the end uh, maybe I'm reversing the end the endings because I didn't I remember like he charged at us at the cliff but that's it and I didn't remember what that was tied to okay we have the part so back to the cathedral spire I swear it would be faster to take the tram to this place it might actually be, because I can escape past those sequences, I believe. Well, we're here now, so... Wait a second. Is two enough? And where's the rest of them? Hmm. Maybe I have to go back to the museum spire? Well, I'm not walking up this again. <laughs> Okay, I, I'm pretty sure two's not going to do it. The alien was right. This thing has already killed one of us. But it's Probably back in, in his place. Pants. <laughs> yeah, apparently it can only fit like two or three at a time anyway. Alright, slot. Oh wait, there are two slots. That's very off-putting, uh, misleading, because we said we're going to need more than two. Although that was his assumption, but it's still, you know. The crystals Brink died for. Something activated. Hear that? Okay. Um, it, do I need to touch these things now? I doubt it. It's a row of crystalline devices. Hmm. I don't know how to work these controls. Well, let us press this button now. Might have to talk to Maggie. I don't know what to do with this device. Great. Okay. Robbins. 
poor prank. Dying one miserable death wasn't good enough. Whatever died the second time, it wasn't Brink. It was the evil of the crystals manifested in Brink's body. I feel like I'm just what he called me. A traitor. A liar. You were dealing with a madman. You were trying to save him, too. I was. Do you think we should try this part in the eye? I tried it. It's probably our only chance of getting home. Now what? Thanks. I actually don't know what to do now. I'm gonna go look for life crystals, I guess. Robins. Oh, you have to talk about the alien device. Okay. See, I would yeah, okay. I get it. I would have tried it eventually. Yeah, that's the hint. Talk to her about the device and she'll turn it on. Okay. Fair enough. All we had to do was talk to her. You're the one who read the alien books. What exactly happens when we turn it on with the Yeah, I talked to her, but I told her I talked about the eye part instead of this. It would have taken me years to read everything, Boston. And I didn't understand half of what I read. But there's no doubt that this machine is dangerous. The alien warned us it might cost us more than we expected. What does that mean? It might mean that just turning on the machine might kill us. Or send us into the sixth You mean he booby trapped the thing? Sense thing. I mean that the machine may draw on more than life crystals. It may drain the life out of whoever uses it. Well, that's not a good theory. Then I'm running the controls. <laughs> Don't be <laughs> upset. Sign me up. It might do nothing, too. Or it could kill whoever isn't at the controls. I just want to tell you. No goodbyes. Hmm. We're going to make it home together, Maggie. I'm not sentimental, Boston. I wasn't going to say goodbye. I just want you to promise me something. Okay. After you saw me break every promise I made to Brink, you want me to make another one to you? What happened with Brink couldn't be helped, Boston. I know you'll keep your word with me. What's the promise? If I die and you live, don't use any life crystals on me. Agreed. Don't revive me. Do you understand? Are you sure? I saw what Brink became. I don't want that to happen to me. You wouldn't be saving Maggie Robbins. You'd be creating a monster with my memories, my face. Don't do it. Promise me. Okay. I promise, Maggie. And vice versa, okay? All right. And now you tell me the truth about something, Maggie. Are you sure you didn't find out somewhere that something bad happens to the person at the controls of this machine? Boston, I don't know any more than you do about what will happen when I switch this thing on. If that's a lie, I'm going to be really ticked off, Maggie. <laughs> yeah, I know. I don't remember this ending at all, or like, what happens. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. Yep, makes perfect, makes perfect sense. How could she have known that? Worth it, it was stuck. What's up, Bucks? Uh -huh. Maggie. Wow.
Oh, same old. Um, I'm probably not going to stream too much longer here, but... Okay, so... I gotta see what happens. I'm sorry, I do. I know I had a promise. However... <laughs> Glowing crystals on Maggie. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, I don't even, I don't ever remember doing this. I have no idea what's gonna happen. <laughs> His smile. Wow. Oh no! Lo! I begged you! Whoa! Ah! Wow. Okay, well... <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna go with that choice. I'm gonna leave her there. As she requests. Wow. I'm sorry, that was a little traumatic. I don't know what to do with this. <laughs> Whatever, we're gonna go into the eye, and uh... <coughs> My goodness. Oh, hello there! Oh, uh, hi! What in the world? I should have known the inventor would have one more trick up his sleeve. So I'm thinking... Will this work? <laughs> Sorry, doggo. But, you know... <laughs> that was the inventor's last chance to stop me. I will get out into space time six. I oh. will bring the people of this place back home, and they will build me a starship that will take me back to Earth. Oh, I for some reason I didn't realize the plan to bring them back was to go there. I, I guess that makes sense. Okay. Sure. Well, we're stronger than that entire race combined. We can get back out, right? <laughs> Here goes nothing. I guess this is the real test. Can a practical guy from Earth do what all the builders of this place failed to do? Spoilers, no, I bet. Can I go into space-time six and still find my way back to reality? Only one way to find out. <laughs> wow. Okay. In we go. Yikes. It's beautiful. A guy could get lost here real easy. No. No, I'm not going any farther into this place. I'm staying here, where I can get back out again. You are as strong as we hoped, human. I can understand you. In space-time six, all living minds communicate perfectly. You stand at the doorway, human. You show us all the pathway back to life, to reality, to a place where we will someday die, yes, but we will have a life before we die. Every past and future, I can see them all, but which one is real? These are all new Go scenes. back now, human. Take me home. 
My people have their bodies, their bones, their lives again. We owe you a great debt, Commander Lo. All I want, now that my friends are dead, is to go back to Earth and tell the story of how they died. Why not let them tell their own story? I wish. You knew the way home, but I know all the other paths through time and space. Wait! Don't go back there! Um... Oh! No way! I have brought you a gift. Wait... What? Maggie! Brink! You're alive again! We were lost, but this being found us and led us back. Maggie, I thought I'd lost you Brink forever. Brink is just... So you really did try to resurrect most miserable looking me person. Crystals. Well... No, I, I promised you. Well. And besides, what the crystals bring back from death, it wouldn't have been you. I know, Boston. You kept your word. And yet, you did find a way to bring me back from death. It wasn't me, but I'm glad you're here. And I'm free of the madness of the crystals, too. He looks different. You did it, though. No, it was our friend here. No, the credit belongs to you. No, no, it was all you. He once revered a great inventor because he opened the door to unchanging eternity. But you opened the passageway back into true life. All I am is a guy who wants to get back home. Already my people are preparing a great crystal starship to take you there. But we can come back, can't we? You and any others who wish to come. <laughs> you are a young people, strong and full of hope and passion. We have much to teach you, and you have much to share with us as well. There will be friendship between our species forever. I hope you're right. Not all human beings are as, uh, nice as us. Oh, I know that. All young species are alike that way. But don't worry. If any of your people try to pick a fight, we'll mash them like bugs. <laughs> How reassuring. The ship is almost ready. Go home and tell your people what has been accomplished here. Telling the people, that's Maggie's job. And getting us home, that was yours. You did it, Boston. Thank you, Boston. We all thank you, Boston Low. Interesting. <laughs> Thought we were about to shake his beard for a second. wasn't too bad. Some of, there were a couple puzzles I remembered, but most of them I did not. At least not the details. And that was it. Alright. Let me, let me, um, what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna cut it off. Well, no. I wanna go back and see what happens if, uh, if I just leave Brink in the crevice, you know? And if I resurrect Maggie in the same... same go of it. I should be able to speed run through that, right? Okay, we did it! Woo! I like that game. It's a great game. Now, I can't skip the credits. <laughs> Cannot skip credits. Okay. That's what I have to do. Choice. Alright, bye Brink! You fool. Now what do we need? Uh, we need the eye part, which means... Do we have to go talk to the inventor right now? Mm. I 
I don't remember which part we were at. Let's let's see. So we never did get that bracelet back. Guess it doesn't matter. Alright. Uh, oh, we haven't even been to the Cathedral Spire yet. I see. Do, do we even have... We have the metal plate. Okay. Okay. I think we have to go to the... Um, what do you call it? The beginning area. And... Do the whole... Um, you know, find the... Uh, you know what I'm trying to say. The metal plates. Go there without brink. Yeah, this part. Open the door. Go look at the machine. Then go talk to the inventor. He'll tell us where to find the eye. Then we go to the beach. Because I don't think you can go there without talking to him first. I mean, you can go there, but you won't see it. We better go find Brink again. Ah. Uh. In case these metal plates do the job. He threatened to kill me the last time I saw him. Maybe it would be safer if we leave him and send an expedition and our There's no guarantee. You're he's worse. They're both but same dialogue. <laughs> we better go Wait. find Brink again. In case these metal plates do the job. Maybe I remember incorrectly. Maybe you have to save Brink. The dig. Do you have to s cut off Brink's hand? It seems like it, yeah. Huh. Well, my memory is wrong. Plain old wrong. <laughs> Let me make sure on the hint site. this. Brink has his hand caught. Okay, help him get it out. You need to cut it off. Very sharp. Okay. Yeah, I guess so. Okay. Well, in that case, I'll just load the other one I had and uh, resurrect Maggie. And then skip that because that was special. No! Lo! I begged you! I can't stand her pixelated face the way it, uh, it's just terrifying. <laughs> um. Okay, so, light bridge. Then there's the dog. dialogue all of a sudden. Did I break it? Bring him back. 
Wait, don't go back there. And there she is. I have brought you a gift. Just one. Maggie. We were lost. <laughs> she doesn't smile Maggie. this time. When you died, I... Man, I'm glad to see you. I don't know if I'm glad to see you, Boston. You broke your promise to me. I'm sorry. I just didn't want to go on without you. But you knew that what the crystals bring back isn't life. It wasn't me. But it's you now. Yes. Well, yes, it is. And I'm free of the madness of the crystals, too. You did it. Cool. Okay, there we go. And there they go. And there's the credits again. All right, GG. <laughs> Commander Lowe, the breaker of promises. Well, it is what it is. All right. Um, I'll hang out for a minute on stream, but let me wrap it up for YouTube. If anyone's watching on YouTube, thanks so much for hanging out and sticking with my stuckness. I'm sure it's frustrating watching someone play a puzzle game, especially if you know the answers. Um, all right. Till the next series. Have a good one. Later.